and welcome back guys to the turn-based chronicles where we are doing heroes of might and magic 4 now do excuse me for my beautiful voice I may be a little bit weak uh, sadly I am very sick and to be honest I shouldn't be even doing this but I have to I have a I have a feeling that I have obligation to finish this no matter how much <laughs> pain I have I have to finish this so that aside we'll continue on from the last time where we yeah we capture a new city I was very happy about it like a little child and sadly enough I might might even lose this city because the red player is around this position with a massive amount of force how that player is gonna combine all of those units I have no idea but the point is they have a huge amount of units from good behemoths which are of course a tier 5 might unit to a cyclops now the thing is my main heroes Araya, Genie and Katy are over this position I've been capturing as much XP as I can and hopefully I will be getting huge amount of levels and I did <laughs> so now we're gonna go for the dream teacher if we have not been here no and then we're gonna go towards our main castle combine all our armies and start doing some damage onto the red player now the point is as there is always a point that I have to also utilize other heroes like I'm utilizing Spock here to see what's happening on this side here we have to realize also where the hell the orange player is because there is a last space for an orange player and that's gonna be a tough one <laughs> because he still has forces he doesn't have of course Braun, which was his best hero level 16 and we did destroy him completely all his uh, great uh, forces and of course immediately we did recapture one of his cities now red player and me may be the only ones with a huge amount of forces and of course huge amount of buildings that is towns on the map now I have no idea what's happening underground we have seen many towns that are neutral and as you can see still are they have no flags over them uh, the, the nice thing is that you can see immediately flags through the fog of war uh, so yeah uh, if they of course they belong to someone or if they don't have any flags they don't belong to anyone so there are two cities that I want to capture also but we'll see how this goes first of all I'm going to concentrate all my massive force onto this part and see how that that alone will go because I do worry that the red player might overrun me at some point here uh, Whoopi Goldberg and Snow Jay are also collecting bunch of XP because after all Snow Jay is level 5 I think level 4 sorry and Whoopi Goldberg is level 5 Lord I have a Ranger and a Lord Ranger doesn't even have a freaking bow that is actually useful I don't even have a fucking bow that is actually useful in real life. Now, that aside, we can end this turn and see, see how this is gonna go. I'm hoping for less problems this time around. As you can see, my enemy... We can't get out of this position, which is the worst. He's blocking my way in. So that means that I'll have to utilize one of our heroes. Though, to be honest, what he has inside is only several uh, burst triggers. I can just do that with Ar uh, Araya, and that's gonna be it. Do we have to worry? Uh, maybe the red player might be around this position. He is now. Let's get uh, that dream teacher. Get that XP. Thank you very much again. Level up. Excellent. Always a good thing. And now we are level 13 general. Oh, sorry again. Uh, I'm hitting my mic sadly again. I'm pretty freaking sick. So do excuse these technical difficulties. Okay, so expert offense attack all friendly creatures by third. Okay, yeah, increases melee and range attack to all friendly creatures by 30%. Always a good thing. Basic archery. We should we should actually take at least basic because range attack to 10. Again, we are utilizing some crossbows which are freaking awesome. Basic seamanship we won't be needing. So expert offense or basic archer. I'm gonna go with that uh, expert offense because I do love to buff my own units as much as possible. Uh, okay, expert estates or basic archery for genie. Genie is our warlord, so 
expert oh my god ex ability to produce an extra 300 gold per day for their kingdom plus 10 percent per level of the hero uh, the thing the problem is that genie is not um uh florissant i think is our first city so she was a governor there i have no idea what happened that she lost that governancy i think as soon as we uh, uh took another hero there maybe that i have no idea what happened there I should find out that at some point, but for now I'm gonna go with uh, expert estates always. We need always the money. It will never be a bad thing if we utilize the money as much as we can or get them as much as we can. Okay, now we're gonna move on with, of course, Whoopi Goldberg and Snow Jay towards an experience trying to get that beautiful experience. Classical stuff right there. And of course, finally, uh, utilizing uh, Spock. Now, Spock can periodically get some units for himself he has a white tiger has some else and a satyr which is a beautiful unit which i call satires but it's not it's satyr why because i say so now i could probably attack this with one of my peasants maybe uh, let me see this one is a closer yes he is yeah i'm gonna try and see what the hell is happening here near this base okay so yes yeah, you can see they have nothing though they will probably buy something to defend this as soon as it is now seen uh, my peasantry so close to their town this is another order town i uh, would like to take it though just for the money's sake now okay now let's buy stuff uh, we have nagas yeah i'm gonna buy nagas always nagas are the most beautiful creature ever known to man have uh, four arms okay four arms and any girl who has four arms can do many things. Let's never forget this fact. So if you find a girl that has four arms, you're a happy fellow. If you're not a happy fellow, then you have certain problems. Okay. I uh, can't buy halflings. I have no room for them. Can't buy, uh, can't buy any of the freaking... Oh, man. <laughs> any of the brew of the freaking golden golems. That's okay. Let's see the second city. Uh, that is Melada, that is the second, well, the first city that we actually captured. We'll be buying some champions and monks, again, the best unit possible. Okay, we'll be buying you guys, we'll be buying you guys, we'll be buying everyone. We'll be buying as much as we can, we have the money, so the money will be used wisely. Manage caravans. They're no okay, okay, so we're gonna create the caravan. Now we go to Aranjan from Melada full completely but it's okay we're only gonna send the most precious units that i know will be useful to me in a long run there that is the uh, army of our um, well araya's army that is uh, we'll be needing some champions we'll need some monks and of course some squires oh damn a wrong thing sorry my bad create a caravan again not there okay from elada thank you very much did i send actually this Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yes, I did. It was him I did. Did I? Florescent. Melada to... I have no idea now. My mind is left and right, and I have no idea. Did I actually send anyone anywhere? So, yeah. Okay, well, that aside, I think we did send. So, yay for us. Uh, so, yeah, they're going for the Melada again. As you can see, we have 13... Um, champions and 12 monks this is a beautiful thing because we have seen that the champions and monks together they can do a massive damage alongside my main heroes do do remember that if i can destroy the red player here with their own heroes that are level five only i could do a heavy ma heavy heavy damage up upon them and that means that the red player is almost defeated i would say uh, we have no idea exactly how many heroes they actually have good ones that is so at lo we have seen only one and that was level five okay that aside uh, do i have any peasantry to utilize to the best effect no i don't but i will utilize this one just to see again utilizing peasants as scout units always a good thing always a good thing let's scout this area now yeah perfect so anyway i will be taking this as, as soon as possible i could do that with spock immediately here just take their stuff but i do want to first and foremost find out what the hell is going on here 
Maybe I should actually utilize not... Yeah, I'm gonna actually utilize Spike to capture that city and everything around it while I utilize one of these peasantry to see what the hell is going on around, across the bridges and all that. So, let's see. Uh, I think that's it. I, I don't have any more money. Nope. So, the only thing I can actually do is end my turn. Let's see how this is gonna go. Oh boy, she missed us. Oh god, that was awful. For a moment I was thinking, okay, we got screwed. Because if she did attack our main hero, uh, she would totally win. I mean, there is no way in hell I would be able to defeat what they had there. She probably has a huge amount, mind you, of units. So anyway, yay, Snow J level up basic, expert basic melee, ba expert combat. Okay, defense, yes, why the hell not? To be honest, I'm not even looking for her because, again, she, those are new. Uh, she is actually a new hero. Uh, sadly, we lost Count Dooku and S. Should I say, and S. So, yeah. Okay, let's see. What should we be doing with her? With him? Oh my god, of course they took immediately a bunch of dragons. Well, what the hell was I expecting anyway? Well, doesn't really matter. I'm gonna capture their shit. I'm gonna be capturing everything they have. Douchebags. Okay, let's see. Yeah, where is my peasant? Okay, you can't really do much anymore. So you're gonna go across the bridge of Casa Dun and see what's happening over there on that side. We are spreading, but even, you know, the thing is, when you spread a lot, you tend to lose the perspective. What the hell are you supposed to be doing? Well, at least I do. Because honestly, I have no idea what the hell am I gonna do anyway. Yeah, yes, I do have great heroes. Yes, I'm sexy like a beast. And yes, I'm awesome. But, there's always a but somewhere. Oh, I could go for the dragons this time around. Again, they're awesome unit. <laughs> they're epic units, so to speak. For, Yeah. Yeah, why the hell not like this? Now that means that I won't be having too many archer units. Yeah, I mean, monks. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, I better have three dragons. And yeah, yeah, I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. Let's see caravans. Uh, there are no caravans headed for Aranjan. Okay, that's okay. Mm, yeah, we have. Oh my god, I sent it to the wrong place. You can see here. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, again, create the caravan from fluorescent to uh, orange. I think no. Yeah, from to. I think this is how it goes. I have no idea. Okay, from... Okay, I think... Oh, man. I, I'm totally confused. But that's okay. That's nothing new. Okay, send that care. That's it, right? Well, I could send every single possible unit. Wait. Yeah. Are you sure you wish to cancel? Yes. Yes, I'm gonna cancel that. Oh, my God. I have no money, right? But God damn it. There are two freaking angels. I want to send them also. That's okay, I'm gonna create... At least that when you send caravans, it doesn't really cost you anything. So from Florissant to Orangian, right? So from Florissant to Orangian. Hopefully this is how it works. As you've seen yourself, it's kinda hard. Also, I can send crossbowmen and these guys. Squires. I could send everyone. I'm gonna send everyone I can. Yeah, why the hell not? Not like I'm worried anyone will be attacking me at some point, so... Yeah, okay. Hopefully this works, though. Uh, do mind you that I don't have much room in uh, Aran Gen that is in this point here. So, that's always a problem. Now, let's see. Now, Nagas. <sighs> not bad creature. We have seen themselves that they're 90 health points, mind you. 7 initiative. These bitches are strong. That's a fact. And then those are five of those. I don't want to put them here, mind you. I'm going to utilize this force as it is now. Okay, the Berserkers are going somewhere, though. I think they're falling back to their own mother base. So, Raya, that has a huge amount of stuff. I think we have set them up nicely again. Yes, yes, yes. All guys that should be in back are in the back. No, the dragons are in the back also. 
so we can put uh, this time genie in the back and dragons in the front and let's move on and see what's gonna happen around this position now mind you the enemy hero is moving towards this position they might outflank us here we'll see okay let's see all our peasantry okay we can't do anything anymore so i'm gonna end this turn and see what's gonna go excellent you're carrying a ride in Melada, but there wasn't enough room to garrison for the troops. They have camped outside. The oh my god, again, I screwed myself up. Honestly, would this work at some point, maybe? No, well, no, okay, well, that's good for us. Melada, my god, <laughs> yeah. it's not working for me. I can't send these guys the way I wanted to do. And the thing is, where are my angels? I sent everyone. If they're in a Melada, where the hell are my angels now? Yeah, I have no angel. I said like they're outside Melada. I'm not seeing them outside Melada. Are you seeing them outside Melada? Maybe we'll see them in the next turn. Have no idea. Have no idea. What what's happening here? Okay. Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna concentrate on actually just ruining uh, some lives with uh, this army. I mean, this is our best army that we actually have. Yeah, you can build your freaking dragons. I will actually just take your stuff and not care about anything. Thank you very much. Whoopi Goldberg. Okay, these guys now. I have their their freaking uh, their experience shrine. This time we're gonna go for the dream features, and then we're gonna combine some armies here. Maybe we'll see how that's gonna go. Uh, okay, I need that one peasantry. Uh, that is across the Casa Doom Bridge. Yes, he is there. It's gonna be quite interesting to see if the enemy even has any kind of uh, a freaking main city here. Though I believe they do. But we'll know soon enough. <laughs> we'll know soon enough. Now you're asking yourself, should I actually now send again? <laughs> I will. I will actually send them. From Melada. This is Melada, right? Uh, from Florescent to Melada. No. We're gonna go from Melada. Two, okay, I should actually from Melada to Orange will arrive in three. Okay, now it works. So let's send just these two now. And of course, Crossbow because we already have some Crossbow in there. Send, thank you. Okay. We're sending it to Orange Just in case. Just in case. All, all in all, that's it. That's all I'm gonna do for now. I, I actually will be sending one of these peasantry here. See, peasant, not that one. This one, just to explore a little bit. Just to know what the hell is going on to the far left. There is a tree of knowledge, always a good thing for anyone if we have the money. And I think we should have enough money. Only one I can buy, really? Oh yeah, these guys are 4,000. They're the big boys. They're the big boys. Oh, I can recruit all four. Nice. Always a good thing. You would think that I would by now win the entire game with this huge amount of armies. And a good units, mind you. I mean, do thing like this, after all. We have defeated Braun, level 16 might character, which was destroyed us a few times by himself, mind you. We have taken one of their cities. And by now, the red player has been everywhere. Almost everywhere. And now we're going to want to kill one of his main heroes, maybe. So it's not going good for them or the orange player. That is, yeah, for the red player or the orange player. Both might characters, might might uh, factions. So I'm only live faction and I'm owning their ass for now. Mind you, I did cry a few times when we actually did lose. And there they go, there they go. Oh my God! So there is their one main army with bunch of stuff, uh, but not that huge. I'm not worried about them to be honest for now. But they're going after Spock now. They're going after Spock and they know it. So they just know it. But I will be taking their stuff while we run away. Oh my god, I have more heroes than gods now. Oh boy. Let's see, level 2 barbarian. Well, the good thing is they have spread themselves a little bit. Uh, that means that I can... A company is like over 100 and something. So that's a lot of freaking berserkers. 
but I'm not worried. I'm not worried at all. I'm, I will go for the smaller ones first. Just to kill off these bastards. There are two freaking heroes here. Level 2. All the evil. Good thing this ain't Age of Wonders. Uh, okay. Well, these guys are running away. Because they say, you know what? Fuck this. I'm not gonna be fighting you. Okay. So this is what I have. Absolutely nothing worth mentioning. But I can only shoot at certain things. So let's kill the Ogre Magi because they tend to be very scary. Very, very scary. But that's okay. Uh, our dragons are in a bad position if they want to attack. But we'll defend as much as possible. The enemy wishes to surrender. Will let the fleet? No. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck, demon. I pressed X, didn't I? Like, what? Oh, God damn it. So now, now I'm getting angry, and I, I shouldn't get angry now, but that's okay. I thought, I, I didn't, it isn't like, no, I said no, right? <sighs> you see, now bad stuff happens. God damn it. Just god damn it. That's okay, that's okay, I'm gonna calm down. Sorry, guys, sorry, I'm, I, I'm not feeling well, and this didn't help. Uh, okay. So we remember that her crossbow, can, he has a flaming bow, well, explosive arrow, that can damage few units at a time, if they are close together. So, let's do this. Well, only, yeah, wouldn't do much. But we'll concentrate our firepower on the Berserkers first and foremost, because there are a lot of those. Now, mind you, there are seven Nagas, and seven Nagas could damage us heavily. Defend, okay. So, we'll concentrate with the Genie, and we'll concentrate only on the Berserkers for now. Okay, for now our initiative is better. Okay, so first and foremost, retribution. Ooh, that's a new one. Retribution is cast on a flying target. When the enemy attacks the target in the melee count, the target will damage base. Oh, so it re oh, okay, it okay, I get what the retribution is. Spiritual armor. When cast on a friendly target, spiritual armor increases melee and range defense by 25%. I'm gonna immediately go for the defender. Just cause. Yeah. Yeah. Low on luck there. That is on me. That is. I, I did. Are we in low on luck? No. No, that's okay. Okay. We'll be waiting a little bit. We'll be waiting. Hmm. Let's go on a dwarves. Five dwarves dead. Okay. I should concentrate also on those Nagas. Nagas are strong. Oh, mind you, I have 13 champions and 3 freaking dragons. I shouldn't worry that much, but I do not like if the enemy gets a little bit too close. Yeah. So let's fire again. As yeah, I didn't have like a uh, area effect much, but I can live with that. So next thing is mass blast. Do I have mass blast? I did have mass, 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 mass blast. Where is my mass blast? Oh, okay, mass blast. That's the next thing I'm gonna be going. Yeah, you, you hurt him. He, the enemy wishes to surrender. Will you let them flee? Uh, th this is no, right? I don't... Uh, oh, I don't... No! What the fuck? Okay, no, fuck this. I'm ending it. I mean... It, it, uh, like... Do you, it, 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 the X means no. I do not accept the fucking thing. What the fuck? Now they have massive two armies, manja. Fuck this shit. <laughs> like, fuck this bullshit. Fuck this bullshit. Oh, God. And I'm gonna reload. I'm gonna probably reload. This is bullshit. <laughs> like... I'm gonna save and quit for now because the, this was awful and I wish you all the best fuck. Okay, welcome back. So it would seem that they did surrender, but they I just didn't took their money. Okay. <laughs> uh, excuse me again for my language. I know, I know, but Jesus, <laughs> I mean I was like this I mean last time we had like that that was they were in the castle though. The besieging that did the freaking Ar Arangen. So I guess they couldn't really like say, you know, like surrender, surrender like they did now. So they all it seems surrendered. Or uh, only heroes surrendered, but their troops ran away to their cities. 
I have no idea. I, I truly have no idea. Uh, so, all in all, uh, I have those heroes in my custody inside our engine. Uh, so, that will be it for now. I will be attacking this city. There's a band of behemoths. Uh, boy. They have several of those thunderbirds. Oh, man. Uh, reality wise oh my god they have actually have one of their better heroes here i could wait it out but i'm gonna attack them now while i can that is not with the now 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 but that will be attacking them at some point anyway thank you for watching again sorry for my bad this will be probably uh, i mean i will probably do it again even though i'm sick i have to do it but we'll see how it goes i wish you again all the best do excuse again for all this madness. All best.